Can I tell you something? I can be skeptical too. Sound check. <laughs> 15th testimony that I wrote down, it's kind of two sandwiched together. When my physical body leaves this world and my spirit man and my soul has a renewed body, a, a glorified body, and I am standing in front of my maker, my heavenly father, when I'm standing in front of my maker, I'm going to be accountable for everything that comes out of my mouth. And I know that. Uh, let me start with the cake testimony. I was baking a cake for my uh, son, Kobe. I think it was his eighth or ninth birthday. And I forgot that our oven was broken. So I go to start this cake. I throw all the ingredients together, mix it up, throw it into the pan. And then as I'm getting ready to place this cake, my son's birthday cake into the oven, I remember the oven's broken. Okay, so the first thing I do is I go next door to ask my neighbor if I could use her oven. But unfortunately, my neighbor's not home, right? So this is what I did. This is what I did. <laughs> I put the cake in the oven and this was my prayer. I said, please, Lord, please. That's all I said. And guess what? That cake baked. God baked my son's birthday cake. And the oven wasn't, the oven didn't just start working again. The oven was broken. The oven remained broken. My husband had to come and get somebody to fix the oven after the fact. God baked my son's birthday cake. Yep. So now let me tell you about my gold water testimony. I'm kind of feeling sentimental because I can't believe I made it to the bottom of this list. Okay, but anyway, um, there was one time where I went to um, a, a prayer meeting, an e evangelical Christian meeting, and the way that they set this up is they'll there's worship and they'll have a great speaker. So anyway, I'm in this meeting and I am worshiping and I'm praising the Lord and I'm singing in English and all of a sudden I just start hearing myself sing in a different language. <laughs> that, that was the evening that God gave me my, my spiritual language and, and I was singing in tongues. I was singing in the tongues of angels and <laughs> it took me a few seconds to kind of comprehend this and it, it, it took me a few seconds to, whoa, hey, what's that? Wow. So as I as I'm praying, as I'm worshiping, I see, I have a vision in front of me that I'm standing in water, um, a, like between my waist and my knees, kind of somewhere there. And I look at this water in the church and I can't believe my eyes. It had like a golden uh, look to it on the surface. There was like a golden hue to everything. And I was like, wow, am I, am I hallucinating this? Is this, is this for real? Oh my goodness. I rubbed my eyes even thinking maybe I was crying and maybe I was seeing through my tears in the bottom of my eyes. I don't know. I didn't know. So, so as I'm standing there in this golden water, I decide to touch the surface and I touch the surface of the water and little ripples go like this throughout the whole church. Yeah. So those are my last two testimonies on the bottom of my infamous list of testimonies. I did it! Good for me, golf clap!